Julie test delay everyone welcome back to my youtube channel and if you haven't yet please it would be my honor please click that subscribe button and also press that bell icon so that you will never miss my new vlogs or new videos so let's begin I was scrolling down my google photo and I found this beautiful video it was taken way back on 8th of May 2017 when I visited my home after 14 years of schooling. Yagi Kulu. We do the whole shearing process with our own hands. Currently, we don't have any technology or machines available for sharing, but if you know some, then please leave in the comment box. Thank you for watching this video till here. What you have seen in this video is we were shearing or extracting the yak's wool. It is a very time and energy consuming task. Even if you do not extract or shear that wool, at the beginning of the summer, yaks lose that wool naturally. So that's why we shear, we shear that and we use it. So I'm going to tell you some interesting facts about yaks wool. Since yak lives at a very high altitude mountainous cold region, yaks fur have two layers. The upper coat, which is called a thipa, which is quite crosser and rougher. The undercoat, which we call as yak wool, which is known as kulu at our region, which is very smooth and fine. The top coat, crosser and rougher one, which we call zippa, we use that to make blankets, robes and tents. And tents for the nomads, right? That tent has a special property of water repelling and waterproofing pop property. And the undercoat, the smooth and fine one, which we called as Kulu at our native language, uh, the, real, uh, the real wool of yak. And you know that how wool are used, right? Wool are used for clothes, garments and many, many things. So thank you. So if you like this video, please click that like button and uh, leave some comments down below if you have any doubt regarding the yaks. And please subscribe to my youtube channel click that subscribe button and also please click that bell icon okay ting ting one thank you stay home stay safe and we'll meet you at another video